like cash in my hair to my ass do the dash can you make it go fast what's up you guys i am back with another video so for today i'm gonna be doing two simple feed and braids and to start off i'm gonna be parting her hair straight down in the middle with my comb and i'm gonna be taking that shine and jam that i showed earlier and just really spreading that across her line to make sure everything is nice and straight and i'm gonna be doing this all the way down to the bottom of her neck Okay, so now that I've gotten to the bottom of her hairline, what I'm going to be doing is taking my shine and jam and basically just placing that in every place that is not going to get braided. What this is going to do is make sure that all of the edges of the braid are super sleek, nice and combed out. So as you can see here, I'm doing the side, just taking the gel and combing. I'm also doing this at the bottom on all the way at the bottom and all the way at the side as well. So I've made my first part at the top and I'm gonna split that into three sections and they're just gonna cross over each other and I'm gonna do a regular Dutch braid. It's important to make sure that when you're picking up your pieces, you do it so that there's no bumps in the piece that you're picking up and also make sure that that piece has had some type of product inside of it so no bumps form as you continue to braid down. So I'm inching towards the bottom now and this color wasn't really her exact color so we decided it would be best to just add this at the bottom for maximum like camouflageness between the hair and her natural hair color so that's why I didn't feed it in at the top. But now I'm just going to take free stretch braiding hair and add it in at the bottom. As you guys can see I'm adding gel to the bottom pieces of her hair to ensure that absolutely none of her natural hair is sticking out and this just makes for a much cleaner and sleeker look. I'm also gonna be combing down anything that may have came up in the midst of me braiding. So yeah, make sure you do this. It's a very important step. Making sure that the tips are gelled down is key in them not coming out at the bottom. So 
now I'm going to be doing the same thing on the opposite side of her head, literally just going to be following the exact same steps making sure that every side of her head is gelled down and ultimately trying to get maximum sleekness with these braids Alright you guys, so we are inching towards the end of this video. This is what the final product looks like. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Do not forget to subscribe, like, and comment on this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate the love.